All right, Shalom. I'm going to start by giving all honor and praise and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Yahweh, the Heavenly Father, who the Word eternally calls God, Yahweh Shah, the only begotten Son, who the Word eternally calls Jesus Christ. All right? They call Halal Yahweh, Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shah. I want to say the water, Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, for giving me the Racha, Kodash, to do another lesson. All right? And that's the Holy Spirit. Double honor goes to the apostles and elders of GMS that rule well. Peace, blessings, and grace and safety goes out to all the Akim, preaching his word and truth and sincerity, all right? The hopeful elect, all right? Shalom to the hopeful uh, uh, one-third remnant, too, that can, um, consists of men, women, and children, okay? All right, so uh, this lesson is basically uh, going to be about, man, uh, 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 getting on uh, uh, our people, man, you, you jakes, man, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, uh, which your biblical nationality would be a, a, a Israelite from the various tribes, okay? Uh, uh, Judah on down to Issachar, man. Okay? All right? That's who, uh, you know? And basically, I'm um, going in, man, how, uh, uh, how two-thirds of our people, the Israelites, are predestined not not to believe the truth. All right? Just as uh, brothers in his faith were programmed to believe in his truth. All right? We've been called. Lord willing, we be chosen. All right? But just as uh, uh, the elect is predestined, all right, so it's two thirds, man, and two thirds of our people are not gonna get this thing, man. All right, as you grow in this truth, man, you come to figure that out, man. All right, just hey, just ain't for this nigga. All right, even it could be your loved ones, all right, your pops, your mom, dudes, your sister, your grandma, your cousins. Like, hey, it just ain't for them, man. They was predestined not to get it, man. All right, cause hey, coming in this thing used to get mad, man. Like, how the fuck Jake don't get this, man? I grew up in the same neighborhood as these niggas. All right, I was a, a nigga just like these niggas. All right, I get it. How the fuck they don't get this shit, man? All right, but hey, you uh, uh, growing this thing, you realize, hey, the Lord predestined uh, two thirds of our people, okay? Or you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, not to uh, uh, get get this truth. All right, you just can't get it, okay? So I'm gonna just read this. All right, this is Matthew chapter 13 and 10. It says, and the disciples came and said unto them, and to him. Why speakest thou unto them in parables? All right, this the disciples talking to Yahweh Shai, okay? And they asking him, why, why are you speaking in parables? Because he just uh, uh, said the parable about the sower, okay? So, yeah, the Bible is written in parables, man, to all you uh, uh, dumb brains, man. We had a, 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 a damn uh, heathen asking us, well, where America at in the Bible then? Or how y'all know that's missiles? Or, or how y'all know this? It don't say that in there. Hey, the scriptures was written in parables, man. All right? It says, And the disciples came and said unto him, Why speakest thou unto them in parables? All right, so this Bible is written in parables, man. Okay? Yahweh Shai about to say why. It's verse 11. He answered and said unto them, Because it is given unto you to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven, but to them... It is not given. That's why, right there. All right, it wasn't predestinated to get this thing, man. All right, the Lord said it was, uh, uh, and to us it was given to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven, but to them it is not given. All right, so hey, brothers, in this note, Lord willing, man, we uh, the hopeful elect. All right, the Lord has given us the uh, uh, hey, the Lord uh, gave us uh, uh, this belief, man. Okay. We know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven. What's the mysteries? That the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans will be ruling uh, uh, the earth, okay? Because heaven going to be on earth, okay? All right? That we're going to be ruling, okay? That's uh, it's chariots in, in the actual heavens, okay? All right? Uh, chariots are going to deliver us. That's how we're going to make it, usher in the kingdom, and various other things, man. Those are the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven, all right? That the Lord has blessed us with to know, all right? And two thirds of our people are, are are predestined not to know, not to understand. Okay, read that one more time. It said he answered and said unto them, because it's because it is given unto you to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven. But to them it is not given. So two thirds of you, so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, it was not given unto you to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven, man. Okay. Verse twelve it says, for who whosoever hath to him shall be given, and he shall have more abundance. But who, whosoever have not from him shall be taken away, even that he hath. All right. 
uh, verse 13, it said, Therefore speak I to them in parables, because they seeing see not, and hearing they hear not, neither do they understand. That's why you how about me outside speak in parables, man. Because hey, we could say this thing plain as we can. Hey, two thirds of our people still not gonna get it. All right, this is uh, hey, the Lord telling you why he spoke in parables. Therefore speak I to them in parables, because they seeing see not, and hearing they hear not. Neither do they understand. All right, so they see us out on the streets. They hear us talking, all right? But they don't understand. They can't see, all right? That's why the Lord got this thing in parables, man, because he got it to the uh, elect to understand this thing, man. All right, and Lord willing, brothers, that's in this thing, truth and sincerity are that number. Verse 14, and, it, and in them is fulfilled the prophecy of Isaiah, which said, by hearing ye shall hear, and shall not understand and seeing you shall see and shall not perceive all right so like i just said hey, they hear the truth they see us out on the highways and bys byways but they can't perceive it they can't grasp it they can't understand why the white man the so-called white man the devil which he's not white he's red and his biblical nationality is esau man the edomites all right the nation who yahweh by shimmy house shot all right has indignation with forever all right they can't see why the so-called white man the devil. They can't see us being on top. They can't see the Messiah being the so-called black man. All right? All right? So they can't perceive that, man. All right? And this was a, a, this was just a prophecy being fulfilled by Isaiah, man. All right? To make these uh, uh, niggas and spicks, okay? Uh, Uncle Tomahawks can't get it, man. All right? It says, For this people's heart is waxed gross, and their ears are full salaki. For this people heart is where it's gross, and their ears are dull of hearing, and their eyes they have closed. All right, that's two thirds of our people, man. All right, ears are uh, uh, stopped up, man. You can't hear it, and their eyes closed, man. They can't see these prophecies. They can't see uh, uh, how true and accurate uh, these scriptures are. All right, but, but the Lord got a, uh, hey, the Lord controls our thing the lord can put it on you to see or he can put it on you not to see it says lest at any time they should see with their eyes and hear with their ears and should understand with their heart or their lob all right and should be converted and i should heal them all right so your how why your house shy gotta heal you man he has to open your eyes to understand this this is not of our own all right that's why two-thirds of our people cannot get this all right it says but blessed are your eyes for they see and your ears for they hear i say we bless brothers all right to hear these things and understand it to see these things and understand to believe in this thing all right we're blessed man all right this is a blessing to uh, be woke to this man all right because your how about shimmy i could easily take it away from you or he could have never gave it to you at all okay like he did two-thirds of our people man all right I'm going to get that prophecy that uh, uh, Isaiah said, man. Okay? All right? Hey, two-thirds of our people were predestined not to get this truth. It's, it is what it is. Isaiah 6 and 9, and he said, Go and tell this people, Hear ye indeed, but understand not, and see ye indeed, but perceive not. Yeah. All right, so they hear us out on the streets, yelling loud. All right? They see us telling them the things in the Bible. All right, the apostles and elders been on the scene 30 plus years, man. All right, people see, people hear. All right, hey, but they perceive not. They can't get it. All right, this is why. Isaiah 6 and 10 says, Make the heart of this people fat at the heart of uh, your, your mind, man, your life. Make it fat. Make it uh, can't understand. Make it clogged up. Make the heart of this people fat and make their ears heavy and shut their eyes. All right, the Lord got these uh, uh, two-thirds of our people blocked off, man. All right? And this just facts. All right? All right? Lest they see with their eyes and hear with their ears and understand with their heart and convert and be healed. All right? So at any time, hey, it's the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son can uh, turn that switch on, that Israelite switch on you and make you understand and make you get it. All right? Lest they see with their eyes and hear with their ears and understand with their heart and convert and be healed. All right, so the Lord can open up your mind and convert you into believing this and you can be healed. Hey, but it's all 
do your how why your how shot, man. We cannot make anybody understand this, all right? You cannot force yourself to understand this, all right? It's all the will of the Heavenly Father, man, okay? Hey, so call Halal Yahweh by Shemi Hashah, that a Yahweh why your how shot got us uh, uh, our eyes open and our ears open, brother, okay? Because it's a beautiful thing, but two-thirds of our people, hey, just meant not to get it, man, all right? So, hey, so the hell of... Uh, Hey, what two thirds of our people, man? All right, you can't get it. Oh well, man. All right, we're gonna give you one or two admonitions, man. And after that, hey, we're gonna reject you, man. We moving on, man. We worry about the elect, man. All right, we worry about the elect. Okay. Hey, so with that, I want to give all honor and praise and glory to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shah Bahashim, Racha Kodash. Hey, peace, love, grace, and safety goes out to all the Akiyam around the world, man. All right, Shalom.